What's up guys, Tiger here bringing you guys a brand new video and yeah, sorry to hit 50 likes on this. And guys, I know there's a lot of controversy going on whether you should update or not right now. I'll let you guys know that I can't guarantee that the jailbreak's going to be out next week or next month. However, remember this, good things only come to patient people. I was told that a while ago, but point being guys, let's get right into how to stop the updates. Now I cannot bypass updates yet, but you can stop them from happening. Why you put your PS4 in rest mode if you like doing that, etc. So basically, guys, I'm going to show you on screen here. You basically just want to go into the main settings. You want to scroll all the way down to system. Go into the automatic download section and simply just unclick the software updates and unclick the automatic install. If you guys want to do some extra, go to your power save settings and turn off the downloads inside rest mode or staying connected to PSN during rest mode, which is what I do just in case. Um, sometimes I leave it on when there's like games coming out, but I'm not on anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. So yeah, guys, that's about it. Um, as soon as I hear info, guys, on any type of way to bypass, I will make a video on that, along with anything else big coming out. As of right now, though, there's nothing huge besides this update, guys, so don't update because you guys obviously want to jailbreak. And if you don't, then knock yourself out an update. Or if you want to be, I guess, on another level of jailbreaking it, or just have an extra console so you can play online and have a jailbreak, then go get a used PS4 because I'm almost confident that all of them are running 3.55 or below. And I'm pretty sure they're about 250 right now. So, yeah, guys, that's it. See you in the next one. Peace.